Hi there Creative Tartanites, thanks for joining me. Today I'm sharing with you a time-lapse process video of how I painted the original painting of this print that I have here. I will tell you a little bit more about why I painted it and how this is going to help raise funds for St Jude's Research Hospital. For those who don't know me, I'm Tanya from Tat and Taz Creates. Let's get started. Thank you for staying to watch me paint this portrait of the art Sherpa as a unicorn. What many of you may know is that although I paint pretty much anything, portraits are my first love. What you may not know until now is that Cinnamon, the art Sherpa, is one of my dearest friends. So when she told me she was doing another campaign to help raise awareness and funds for St Jude's, the Children's Research Hospital, and asked me to join in with my own campaign, I jumped at the chance. You see, I had this idea in my head that I thought would be fun to do and it would be well received and at the end of it I could raise some money for St Jude's Research Hospital. I will of course need your help, but before I ask for that help, let me explain a little bit about why we're raising funds for St Jude's. Over the years, St Jude's has offered hope to many, many children and their families, regardless of where they came from, what colour their skin was. And the most frowned upon part, particularly in the beginning, is that this treatment was offered for free. They have treated very difficult to treat childhood diseases. They have reduced the death rate in children with cancer. And unlike any other children's hospital, St Jude's offer a treatment that no longer causes brain damage when operating on brain tumours. For more specific details on the diseases that are treated and the treatments that are offered and how you or anyone that you know can access these treatments, remember it doesn't matter where you live, you do not have to live in the States to access this hospital. I believe there's even help available for you to access these treatments. Please check out St Jude's website which is on the screen at the moment but I will also leave a link in the description below. So there you have it, some very powerful reasons why I really want to ask for your help. So let me cast your mind back. Do you remember I said that I had an idea? Well, my idea was obviously to paint a portrait of the art Sherpa. However, it wasn't just any old portrait I wanted to paint, I wanted to paint her as a unicorn. As anyone who knows the art Sherpa will know that she absolutely loves unicorns. I also thought it was very fitting because what St Jude's can offer to sick kids can be viewed by many as magical and obviously the unicorn is a magical creature. So let us all do some magic of our own right now and raise some funds and awareness which is equally as important for this magical cause. For the raising funds you have two choices. You can either purchase one of my limited edition prints of the Art Sherpa Unicorn and I will donate for every print bought $10 to St Jude's. Alternatively I will leave a link to my campaign that you can click on and donate some money. Every dollar donated to my campaign will get me closer to my goal of $100 and I have promised that if I reach $100 I will go out in public and do something with my Jedi costume on. I will either film this or take photographs and share it with everybody. Now feel free to leave me a message on my campaign when you donate offering suggestions of what you would like to see me do in my Jedi costume. Of course, all suggestions would need to be legal and not get me into trouble. If you're not in a position at the moment to make any donations, fear not, there are still loads of ways in which you can help. First of all, you can just simply spread the word about St Jude's Hospital. And the other way is if you were to share this video with people, let people know that uh, this portrait uh, in print form is available. That would be a really big help to me and it would also raise the chances of people purchasing this portrait which would then in turn obviously raise funds for St Jude's. So either way it's a win-win situation. 
Alas, I am not selling the original painting because I gave it as a surprise gift to Cinnamon, hence the secrecy. Now the little birdie tells me that Cinnamon is going to show off the original portrait during a special live event on Monday. So we'll go and check out her Facebook page, The Art Sherpa, for further details and you should be able to find a link somewhere for her campaign that will give you some details. Here are a few fun facts about this portrait painting before I go. I painted this entire portrait of the Art Sherpa using the Art Sherpa brushes that I own, which are the cat's tongue size 4 and size 8. And lastly, but by no means least, the most difficult part of this portrait was not being able to share my progress photos with my friend because she is the recipient of the secret painting. That has to be the hardest secret I have ever, ever had to keep. That just leaves me to say thank you very much for watching to the end. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already done so and don't forget to click that bell so YouTube gives you notifications that way you don't miss out on any future videos. Bye for now, I'll see you all in the next video.